happy day. Okay, so I um, have a lot going on. And then I went to the Dollar Tree and picked up some things. And I wanted to show you um, everything that I got. So let's get started. Hopefully no one comes running through the room. <clears throat> okay, so first of all, I will show you some important stuff. Okay, so had to get my daughter a planner for school. And uh, this was from Walmart, but like, I'm gonna make sure I don't show you what she's got going on. Okay, so like, that's the month of July. And we use stickers and stuff and it tells her everything that's going on even if it's like her dad's birthday and like it says mama be at the hospital getting a lung function test at this time so she knows where to find me where i'm at um her brother and sister's birthdays her cousin's birthdays it's all right here i even keep track of i write down when she has a period because she goes like um three four months without one and so we're getting ready to start birth control so i want to make sure that she's aware of like when she has one so um i didn't want just like the stickers that go on the planner so whenever i was at um Walmart, uh, dollar tree yeah. i found some um stickers that um go to I found some of these um, post-it notes. I like these ones with the arrows. Um, I thought this would be great for school. It does have the holes poked in it here. So like you could put it in your binder. The holes right, well it's hard to see. So it has holes. But what I do is, is I take this out of here and I use it inside of her um, planner. Like I mark things that are severely important I need her to remember. And then also the Dollar Tree has a whole bunch of stickers for planners. And I do not know where I stuck them at because I was using them to do her planner. Okay, um, they have this... Um, let's see what this says. It says, um, genius inside, 100% brilliant, mind blowing. They have these books you open up. Over here, you have my genius ideas. Down here, you have, um, unforgettable, but just in case, down here. And then over here, you have big plans. And it's got lines. So I have this one. My daughter actually bought me that one. And then... Um, oh. Okay, so... And this is my other one. It says, you can do this. And then on the inside, it says... Things that you don't need to forget. Uh, keep it up. Doing great. Almost done. And then it's got, okay, so it has this list here where you can write down what you need to remember. And over here it has the Monday through Sunday where you could write what you have going on. And then when that week's over, just tear that sheet out. I actually have something wrote on mine because there was a family who had a fire and I wanted to make sure that I found them. And, um... I'm just going to tear that out of my planner. Okay. Then. I picked up these pens. The other one. Is inside of this. <coughs> oh sorry. God bless me. Um, these are the big Jello City. These ink, ink pens. are They're called Smooth Stick Gel Pen. These are some of the best ink pens from the Dollar Tree. I absolutely love them. And I picked up my daughter some of these um, soft scripts. They're uh, mechanical pencils. 
and they have the soft grip right here. That was just something I picked up for school. They have the giant squishies. Some are scented. Um, we have a bunch of these, but they are all over the house. And they have the poppets, the animals. They got we got the unicorn, the dinosaur, the circle, the and you pop the bubbles in and you pop the bubbles out. So we have those two. Okay, so this may sound strange, but trust me, it's not. <laughs> okay, so we went to Jellystone Park in Eureka, uh, Missouri by Six Flags. And they actually served lunch on a Frisbee that had their um, name on it. So it was like the neatest thing. The kids really enjoyed it. And the Frisbees were washable. And we just kept reusing them. I mean, the kids didn't mind at all. They were nice. And they, we had run out of paper plates. And they were left. So we picked up um, a tiger. Um, Jaden loves tigers. And picked up a shark one from Madison. It's blue and it has green sharks. And she loves the color green. And she likes blue. And Jaden um, absolutely loves tigers. She's not a fan of the color orange. But she likes tigers. So what you do is you want to make sure you get that out. You can line it if you want to with some paper or something. But you put the kids' food in here in the Frisbee. They can carry it. It's not going to spill. And they eat out of it. And you can just keep refilling it. Um, they served ours with um, hamburgers, or no, hot dogs, chips, and a soda in the Frisbee. Um, when we bought them at Jellystone, I actually have them here. Um, from up there and they're the same size. I got these at the Dollar Tree. They have all different colors and um, Then you just wash it and they reuse it and they love it because they're eating out of a frisbee um, No, we don't play with it and then eat it eat out of it I picked up the battery um, powered pencil sharpeners and multiple different colors Okay, so I'm sure you've seen these little boxes at the Dollar Tree. You open them up, and they're for meds. You, it opens up that way, and then it opens up this way, and it has all these. Um, it has the small pockets, it has the long pockets, and it has this big blue one. I turned this into my daughter's grab-and-go tackle. So she's, she's got um, some hooks, some sinkers, some swivels. Um, she's got her... Um, Pink bait, white, the lake's going to be muggy, so you need colors like white, black, blue, anything fluorescent. Um, so the pink would be really good, and I'm going to give her a couple pieces of my bait, too, to put in here. And over here, she has her little minnows, shads, and then she's got her hooks. Well, come on. Um, like, she's got the the hooks with the head that goes on her bait and these are all things that came with her fishing pole on her starter kit and I just throw them all inside of this little Dollar Tree thing normally I turn these into medicine boxes or first aid kits but I decided to do an on-the-go tackle box which is not finished yet and it no it will not hold a bobber so I also bought this organizer and I may transfer her tackle into here I'm not sure yet because the um, the bobbers do fit in this. So I'm not quite sure what I'm doing with that yet. Um, I bought some of these little hooks to put in our tent. Um, forgot what I'm going to use them for. I'm not really sure yet. I have the Clorox. Uh, make sure it's not scented. The Clorox bleach you need that and an eyedropper and you should always keep it inside of your home um, in your um, bug out bag in your bag to get home um, however you prep two eyedroppers eyedroppers um, for a quart of water and let it sit shake it up and everything will make it drinkable like i said this will last you a very long time do not get this this is if this is like lavender or something you're going to be bleh. it tastes nasty 
two eyedroppers. So next time you're at the Dollar Tree and you grab one of these, grab an eyedropper. Our baby, baby medicine dropper. Two tiny drops of Clorox bleach will do a lot of water. A lot. So if the water's not drinkable, this will help it if you cannot um, get your water in any other kind of way. Okay, so I bought two of these um, containers. I'm sure you guys have seen them um, a lot. These, these containers are usually always at the Dollar Tree. Why is this thing not wanting to open for me? I'm going to open this up. I'll show you exactly what I'm doing with it. I am so tired of stuff being in my car. Back to my car. I don't know about you guys, but when my kids get out, it looks like um, hurricane something come flying through the back seat. I'm just sick of it. Okay, so this is the exact size of the underneath of your back seat. You can put this under your back seat, make sure the handle's facing forward, and pull it out. Keep your kids' toys in there, um, some on the go cups, things that you might need. Um, movies for your DVD player, just whatever, and it's all like right there for you to grab the handle and pull it out. Don't have to worry about the kids having crap everywhere. <clears throat> I picked up two of these light switches, they do take batteries. I'm going to velcro these to the walls of my tent that way I can. Um, the girls can flip the switch the light switches on they are extremely bright i actually have these in my house i picked this up because it puts the fish aquarium on the ceiling and it reminds me of nemo i'm going to put this in my daughter's tent my girls uh, my daughter is 14 and then the other one is 11 and um I just think that projecting this on the ceiling gives it more of a, will be by the lake, so it gives it more of a vibe of, you know, the water. I think they'll like it. Maybe they won't. I got some dry erase markers because I have a big giant thing on my refrigerator that does the month and then it does days of the week and whose chore is what. So I have two of those, one for each seat. Okay. <clears throat> These here were not what I was looking for when I went back. I found what I was looking for. But you go ahead and fill this up with your eggs. Go ahead and whisk them. And then pour them in here. Let them get full. And just keep the top popped. You can put a piece of um, duct tape over this if you like. Make sure it doesn't leak. I'm just going to set mine down in the cooler. You can do that with both of these depending on how many people you have going. You can also do this with pancake mix and then just add the water, shake them up, and then squeeze them into the pan. Um, you can also put um, your barbecue sauce. Um, if there's something that you're going to use the whole time you're gone and you're going to be gone for a while and it's worth filling these up for, by all means, these are really good bottles. They're BPA free. Um, I'm going to put the eggs in mine. Um, whip them and put them in here I'm probably going to do two with eggs and then two I'm going to buy another set and I'll have two with pancake mix I'm not sure yet um, but that is definitely what I'm doing with these is the eggs and my child's barbecue sauce okay so they have these containers at the Dollar Tree and they have the see this is a three pack okay so it's a really cute color too they lock. I love that about them. They fall on the floor. They don't spill. They're not very deep. But if you watched my previous video, I made first aid kit in here. Um, I'm going to use this to, to put some things in that the kids will need. And I'm going to drop them into their buckets. Um, also, when you're fishing, you may need a small first aid kit. But I've already made these and shown them to you. I can do that again if you want me to so like normally these come like in blue black or gray and you only get two 
But this was a bonus pack that came with three. So I was lucky and got three. And I just, I love the color. It's a really pretty color. I picked up the, um, I picked up the shower caps. Now, normally, I do, um, I think it's like a six pack of different colored shower caps, like blue and stuff. But I got the clear ones. We're going to use these to cover food. You can also, I've told you guys in videos before, take these and put your um, shoes in them so they don't get sand all inside your tent. Um, so when you're packing them to come home, your car ain't full of dirt and stuff. So you put shoes in these. Uh, Flip-flops go in these really great. Uh, bottom, bottom of the tennis shoes. Um, food. Cover the bowls so that the ants don't, or flies don't get all over everything. Now this is a new find for me. I picked up this um, Maximum Strength Lidocaine 4%. Pain and Itch Relief Cream. This is for everything. Even burns. And I've never seen the Maximum Strength one. This one here is really going to be um, good to have in the first aid kit. I picked up some Camelback bandages. Because these are the actual flexible um, fabric band-aids. Um, my husband does not like um plastic band-aids they fall off you can't get them to stay stuck. and where we're going there's water so my husband says that the flex flexible fabric band-aids are the best not the plastic ones the plastic ones just fall off so these are the camo fabric band-aids okay and then um, I picked up these letters, got this in gold, and then I got these small black ones. I'm going to use those. I have a Cricut that I could use, but I'm going to use this for now. I picked up these containers. They have a uh, pink. They have them in blue. And they have them in this light purple and pops open and you can fill them up and I think this is a really good idea for um, taking and carrying um, them to like the shower house um, they would also be good for um, storing stuff in these that you need be beside your bed in the tent like um, your phone charger um, maybe just some, maybe your medicine, maybe just some things that you need by the bed. I'm wanting to use this and sit a phone stand on top of it, and hopefully it's high enough to actually prop my phone, because last time we went, I had nowhere to put my phone. So I'm going to try one of these so we can watch movies. And I bought, I bought five of these. I bought three pink, a purple, and a blue. So, if I decide to do what I'm planning to do with these, um, I may turn the blue one into my husband's. Um, but I'm not sure yet. It's just going to depend on how he feels about um, the blue. But it's like the perfect way to go, you know, back and forth to what you need to do. Or like I said, just besides the bed beside the bed if you covered the top of this with something where the handle is you would have like a small um table okay i picked up another pack of of the um double batteries so i picked up two of these and i'm gonna do two um I'm going to do two of these per person. There is um, four of us, but my husband doesn't really use them. So what I'm going to do is I'm um, going to do shampoo and conditioner. It's probably what I'll put in these. 
I'm not sure yet. I will figure that out and let you know. I'll show you when I make the caboodles when I'm putting in them. I picked up a Dr. Seuss uh, 2022 calendar. I love Dr. Seuss and I heard that they're going to stop making him because something is offensive about Dr. Seuss, which I'm yet to figure out what the fudge it is. I mean, if it's green eggs and ham, I hate to be in your life. I picked up this dartboard, which I picked up one of these in my haul before for camping, but it only had the little balls with it, and it was like real bendable. This one has the darts and the balls. So the darts have Velcro tips, and so does the balls. So if you Velcro this in your tent, and you're stuck in there for the rain, um, of course, you know, my husband is swearing it in the middle of their bullseye, but he can't. So we'll probably hang this up um, on one of those hooks or with some Velcro. I'm not sure. I picked up these lights. I love these. I have a green one and I have a yellow one. Um, let's see if I can get this up. Okay, so that's the front light. And then you've got this light. So like when you're walking... It goes really far. Um, so, I mean, it's a really good light. The kids like to use them. And then I bought some of those squishy balls. Which you put um, in the water. Go about each other. Okay. And then I made... Ah, I made my... Um, my girls some bags and I will show you one of them that I made I picked up the mermaid um, notepad a box of Crayolas the ball that has the glow stick pencil for the notebook picked up the Bible coloring book tropical party and then this is the faces you put the stickers on the faces of the Disney characters Mrs. Potts see like all the different and you have the stickers to do their faces and then both my girls have two of these comic books. This is the Mickey Mouse one and this is the Frozen one. The host set is a Mickey, a Frozen, a Toy Story, and a Princess. And my other bag for my other daughter has the uh, Toy Story and the Princess. And then I picked up a Spot the Difference. And that's another thing they can do with their pencil. I like to race my husband at these so you can find the pictures first. But it's, um, you see which, what's different on each page. And then I have this really neat uh, catacorn and dinosaur purple bag to put all her stuff in because she likes the color purple. And um, also gives her... She likes um, the little cats and dinosaurs. She thinks they're funny. So I put all her stuff in the bag. And her little Crayolas. Her, I mean everything. Even the little ball that glows. And it's all inside of the dinosaur and catacorn bag. So this is her bag. And then I made a bag for the other one. She likes lemons. So I did a lemon bag, and in the lemon bag I did around about the same thing. Um, we have a Bible coloring book, and it hers is Daniel in the lion's den. She has this coloring book that she likes the different creatures inside. She has this um, Disney one with the stickers. To make their faces. Mm -hmm. 
and she absolutely loves Stitch, and he is in here somewhere. And there's Alice in Wonderland. So she has that one, and then she has a Spot the Difference. Let me think. Hers is a little bit different. And then she has the yellow ball with the glow stick. And here's the other two coloring book or comic books to the set. Toy Story and the princess she loves Pocahontas. It's her favorite princess. And then she has a pack of Lisa Frank stickers. She absolutely loves Lisa Frank. So she has the Lisa Frank stickers to do whatever she wants with. And then she also has a monster and her pencil and her Crayolas. And then I just put everything back in the bag. And it doesn't, like, this could be used for traveling or anything. Um, you know, depending on, you know, what you're doing, where you're going. And my kid's 14, so it doesn't matter what age they are. If they're bored in the car or, you know, if it, you're reined into your campsite and then you just zip it up and all her stuff is inside the little lemon bag and then I picked up a watermelon one we had another child going I have not got this one finished being filled but I did put in a sticker puzzle book which these are really fun because you just find the page and you use this and you actually make the picture with the stickers. You Like this page is just made with the stickers. And then it's a spot the difference Spongebob. And then I'm going to put a coloring book in here. And some um, colors and probably some paper and stuff to write on. And I have the bigger container from the Dollar Tree. And inside of it I actually have those little balls I showed you. And that's where I store my bags for the trip. That way I could just take them from my car and put them straight into the tent. Or if we need to pull over or something happens, then, you know, my kids have the container um, in the car. And that's also where I store my games go in there. And then these are, like I said, the Frisbees that they, you actually can eat out of these. Ah, my friend said they're not eating out of Frisbee. They don't give a crap. They're not doing it. But um, my kids think it's really cool. We did it at um, Great Wolf. And we have a restaurant here in Missouri that you go to and you eat out of dog bowls. It's actually called the Dog House. And their food is amazing. But, um, yeah, I just think these are so neat. And they have a different... Um, different colors I may still pick me and my husband up one because at the wash station they're just easy to wash okay and then I want to show you this bag oh let me get this bag real quick okay so I put everything inside this bag I buy these bags off Amazon and I love them so I have the rope that you dip in bubbles and it makes the really big um, bubble thing. They have a shark football and then they have a uh, these little stakes that go on the ground and it's for these horseshoes. We actually do have um, washer sets and all that stuff, but this was just cute. I could put it all in this bag. And then I have um, these rings that you put on the ground. And then you take these things here and you toss them into the rings like you would um, like lawn darts. We just made them a whole lot safer. 
And so I also put that inside of that container so I have it just in case, um, you know, they would need it or, or whatever. It's, it's ready to go. And then I put it on the bag and I zip it up. And that way I have everything that the kids could possibly need right here in their bag along with the uh, dartboard and stuff. And since that stuff can't hurt nothing, you can use it inside the tent as well. Okay, so that's everything I have for my camping stuff. Um, I <laughs> We've been doing funny videos on TikTok. So we found this tiny mayonnaise. And this is our tiny sugar. We have the video done with our mayonnaise. We haven't got the video done yet with our sugar. So, um, we'll be posting that real soon. And then I'll probably just take that stuff camping too. So, um, that is all for this video. I'm going to post another video behind this one showing you a bag that I've made for my car to keep kids busy in the car. So, from our family to yours, God bless you and have a great night.